Speaking style. If you felt that someone around you was not performing as well as they should, would you come to the point and tell them directly, or would you hint, imply, and give them cues? Someone who came to the point and tells them directly is literal. Someone who hints, implies, and gives them clues is inferential. Very interesting. A literal listener may not know when an inferential speaker compliments them, yeah? And an inferential speaker may think that any question is a request for action. Now, inferential listeners, you start talking to an inferential listener about something, and you say, you know, I went to the movies the other day and I saw a great movie. And the inferential listener goes, is he trying to tell me something? What's he trying to say? Do they want to go to the movies tonight with me or something? What do I need to get from this? And then the literal speaker isn't even thinking about that, right? They're just telling the story about the movie, you know, and the inferential speaker is gone. Like, what does she want? Is she hitting on me? This is uh, very valuable, especially in relationships, but also on the job because a literal listener will not even know when an inferential boss compliments that person. Imagine you have an inferential boss, right? And a literal salesperson. So the salesperson will probably not understand when the boss gives them a job to do. So the inferential boss might say something like, well, you know what would be a good idea? I thought of actually cleaning up my desk the other day. And the literal salesperson will be like, Oh, that's weird. I wonder why the boss is telling me about his desk. But he never draws the inference, right? Because he's literal. You know, and in the meeting, the boss may say, I wonder if we could develop a new business relationship with that particular business. I wonder if that would be a good idea. The salesperson will be like, oh, oh, okay. That's interesting. The boss is wondering. No problem. So... So these last three metaprograms are super interesting. There was a person whose husband had a rough day, right? And the husband had a rough day and he's an internal processor. The wife has an external processor and she's an inferential listener. He's a literal, literal speaker. So he comes home and she says, how's it going? And he goes, oh, it's all right. And she's like, what happened today? How was your day? And he's like, eh, don't worry about it. It was okay. And she's like, what happened? I mean, what did you do? And he needs to process. So he's like, I'll be back. So he goes over and he sits in the corner and processes for an hour, right? And she's freaking out, right? Because she's going, what did I do wrong? What did I do? He's not talking to me. What's happening? What's up? I must have done something wrong. Look, he's just sitting over there in the corner, and he's not paying any attention to me, and he hasn't talked it out, and I need to talk. That's always how he is. He never lets me talk. I feel like I can never say what I want to say, and there's never room for me to just look at him. He's never paying attention to me, and by this time, she's all worked up, right? And he's done, so he comes back and goes, Okay, let's go out to dinner. You ready? And she's like, what? And she's like, she's already freaked out because he didn't pay any attention to her at all. And then by then, he's totally fine because he was processing his own stuff. Interesting the things that does to a relationship, right? By the way, in a relationship, often we get into a relationship with our opposite because we need to learn the opposite thing to integrate fully. Someone who's an internal processor won't share his or her thoughts or feelings with the other person. And an external processor will feel a need to draw them out and have them express their feelings. And that's because this has to do with information processing style. Now, if one of the partners is an external processor and the other one is internal, as well as the differences between one of them is literal and the other one is inferential, the first person who needs to talk and is an external processor, this person has to say, I don't want anything from you, right? 
I just want you to listen. Just sit there. Don't say anything. Don't do anything. Right? Just listen. I need to dump and all I want you to do is just listen. Then that way the other one knows. Otherwise, the person's going to be sitting there wondering, well, what does she want from me? What should I do for her? Right? So give them a heads up. This will really help with relationships. These last three are very interesting meta programs, and they explain a lot about relationships.